Hi, welcome to BlueFX.net. My name is Marcelo. Thanks for buying this last template called Tron Ignition. And I'm here to show you how to customize all the stuff inside this project. First of all, I will show you where you will find the Tron Ignition file in your delivery folder that you receive. Just open it by double click. And you will see here the Tron Ignition folder. Inside this Tron Ignition folder, you will find the Tron Ignition After Effect project. Just open it by double click it. By the way, in the same location of Tron Ignition folder, you will see another folder with two free fonts. These fonts you need to install in your system just to keep the same font that we're using on the project. These fonts are delivered for free by urbanfonts.com. Okay? Let's go to the project. As you see, this project contains a music track. This music track we use to make the whole template. So let's hear how it sounds in the preview video. Okay, in the 00 main composition you will find these four text compositions called 01, 02, 03 and 04. Each one of them contains text and secondary text that you can change. In the next composition called Tunnel you will see three different containers for image, footage and text to change also. In the next composition, call it City Traveling, you will see another three different containers for image, footage and text to change. In the last composition, call it Your Logo here, you will find the way to add your logo and your slogan to the final project. All the composition that you need to change text and footage are contained here in the project manager in this folder called 01 Your Change. Please double click to open it. All the composition inside this folder are named according its use. So if you want to change the text inside this composition called text 01, you just need to open this composition called input text 01. Let's open it. Inside this composition you will find in the timeline this text object changing the text here you will change the text in this composition so let's change it make a zoom out with the mouse wheel and double click in the text to change it we will type here a new text Tron ignition let's go to the first composition to see how the text has changed by the way, if you want to change this composition, you only need to locate in this folder this composition called secondary text 01. So open it and you can change here the text. Let's go to the first composition again to see how the text has changed. The process to change the main text and the secondary text for the other three compositions is the same. You only need to locate the input text 02, 03 and 04 for the main text and the secondary text 02, 03 and 04 for the secondary text for the rest of the composition. Ok, we are now in the next composition called Tunnel. As you can read here and here you have a little help to locate the right composition in the you change folder. For example, if you want to change this text 05 text here, you only need to locate the input text 05 to change the text inside. Just open it by double click and change the text. For example, I will type here other text. Go back to the main composition to see how the text has changed. Okay? And it's the same way to change the 05 secondary text here. You only need to locate the right composition. 
secondary text 05 so let's open it by double click and change the text Let's go back to the main composition to see how the text has changed. It. Okay, I will show you now how to change the image or footage in the 01 footage container. You only need to locate the image input 01. Just open it by double click and change this footage. For example, I will zoom out this image to see an entire the same and I will use another footage from the other comps folder now we'll use this one just to replace this one so to make a, a real-time switch you only need to drag this file holding alt key to this go back to the main composition to see how the image has changed by the way, if you don't want this text over the image, you only need to go back to the image input composition and turn off the text element. Go back to the main composition and you will have the entire image as it. OK, it's the same way to change the rest of the element in this composition color tunnel. You only need to locate the right composition related with the element inside this composition. Let's move the indicator to see the next okay this one for example if you want to change the zero sex text here you only need to locate the input text zero six and for the secondary text you have to locate the secondary text zero six and if you want to change the footage inside this container you only need to locate the image input zero two OK, this is all for the tunnel composition. Let's move on to the next composition called City Traveling. This composition has another three different containers for text, secondary text and image or footage. If you want to change every element inside this composition, you only need to locate in your change folder the right composition according with the numbers of the elements. For example, if you want to change the 08 text here, you only need to locate the input text 08. If you want to change the 08 secondary text here, you have to locate the secondary text 08. And if you want to change the image inside the 04 image or footage container, you have to locate the image input 04 in this case and it's the same way to change the rest of the element inside this composition ok this is all for now for this composition let's move on to the last one call it your logo here let me show you ok I will show you now how to fit here your logo and your company slogan for the first one you only need to locate in the your change folder this composition call it logo input just open it by double click it and let's see how to change it here the process is the same you only need to select the text and retype what you want ok now let's move on to the my composition to see how the text has changed by the way if you need to fit here a different kind of design you only need to open this composition your logo here by holding alt and you open it and locate logo extrude let's open it by double click holding alt well you have here an adjustment layer with a logo outline control mark this adjustment layer contains an effect to control the outline of the logo that you fit in the logo input composition ok let me show you how it works just go to the logo extrude select the adjustment layer and you will see in the effect control this slider typing a new value in the slider 
for example I will type 3 you will see how you will you will see how the you will see how the Oland is modified. You will see how the Oland logo is changed. I will type here another value, for example nine. As you see in the logo, the Oland thickness is stronger. If you want a thinner Oland, you only need to modify this value for a minor value. For example, I will type here two. As you see, the thickness has changed again. That way you are able to control your logo outline thickness depending on your logo design. Let's see on the main composition how all the text has changed. Ok, this is all. I think that you know now all the things that you need to change and customize your projects. Thanks for your time and don't forget to visit us to see what is new on blueeffects.net. Thanks. Bye.